Hello and welcome back to my channel. I'm Amber Nicole and this week I am showing you how I do my everyday hairstyle which is my go-to curls. I'm going to give you a step-by-step -step on how I do it. I get people all the time asking me how I do my hair and how I get my curls and what rollers I use and this, that, and the other. I am showing you today so let's get started. The hot rollers that I use are by Remington and I got them at Target. Highly recommend that you get these clips. I got them on Amazon for like 10 bucks for 10 of them. I don't like the clips that the rollers come with, so I buy these. So I start off sectioning off the top, and you wanna do all your big rollers at the top, and then you wanna do all your skinny rollers at the bottom. I start sectioning off right here because I kind of let my hair fall however it wants to, whether it's on this side or whether it's on this side, I really don't have a specific part. So yeah, that's why I section it off up here first. I have really long hair, so it's kind of hard for me to get all of my hair in the roller. So all I do is I just go as far as I can, as you can see, and then I twist it around like that. And then I just roll it up or down, I guess. <laughs> and then I just roll it nice and snug and then clip and then there you go if you have shorter hair it's a lot easier to get the hair around the roller but for me since I have such long hair that's really how I have to do it because I don't have long arms I normally will put like three to four rollers on top of my hair here is how I another way and make sure that the rollers are very hot. I know the box will say like, wait 10 minutes before you put them on. Yeah, if your rollers aren't burning your fingers, they're not gonna work, I don't think. So make sure your hair is very dry. Do not let your hair be damp at all. Make sure your hair is completely dry. I would say for the best results, shower at nighttime and the next day, put your, like make sure your hair is dry, put your rollers in. Your curls will stay in longer and your hair will just look nice and voluminous. That's what I recommend. From there, I part my hair. Same thing, we're still putting the fat rollers up. Depending on how you want your curl, I like my curls to go out like this. So I'm gonna roll it this way, like that, see, fix that. So all I do is I just roll it up. Clip and just keep on going. Remember, put all the fat rollers on the top and then all the skinny rollers on the bottom. You don't want to put too much hair in your roller. Make sure like it's just a nice little thin piece. I recommend using all of the rollers like I have 20 rollers in this thing and I use every single one of them I have very thick hair so I have to so I have to use all of them but if you have thin hair and you don't think you need all of them I still recommend using all of them because even if you have thin hair you might think it might be too many curls but I promise it won't be you have to remember with hot rollers, they're not gonna stay that curly all day, okay? Just remember that they are gonna fall a little bit, but it's gonna give you this nice like wavy curl look and it will look nice. So that's why I say don't be scared. Like as soon as you take the rollers out, it might look crazy, but don't worry, like it will fall eventually. Now we are at the end of our hair. I'm gonna start using the thin rollers. This 
side is done. As you can see. Same thing, I'm gonna go in the same direction. Still gonna put the fat rollers on top and then the thin rollers on the bottom. makes perfect okay I have been doing this whole gig since about eighth grade okay this is my go-to hairstyle for if I'm going to dinner if I'm going to the store if I'm doing whatever like if I want to look like I tried this is what I do my last roller Now, I would say the longer they're in, the better. If you need a time frame, I would definitely say anywhere from 15 to 30 minutes. If you're getting ready in the morning for work, put the rollers on before you put on your makeup or, you know, do your makeup, put your rollers on, and while you're like going and getting your coffee, getting things ready, have your rollers in your hair, take them out as soon as you're ready to leave. For me, I have thick hair, so I leave them in as long as possible and my hair will just like, look great but yeah so now we wait then just take them out sometimes they'll get stuck in your roller like mine do but just gently pull them out don't be alarmed try to pull them out in like the direction of the curl like the way you rolled it up like try to unroll it like that if that makes sense if you roll them pretty tightly then it shouldn't be too big of a mess to like pull them out Depending on how you like your hair, how you like your curls, you can brush them out and get like that nice wave going on if you want. I do not brush my curls. I immediately put hairspray on it. I'll do this like little zhuzh with my hair and kind of let them like fall all together. But the next step, um, very important, I use this hairspray, best hairspray ever, the only hairspray that holds my hair got to be hairspray and it's the only hairspray that works for me um, like i said i have thick hair so my curls will fall if i do not put hairspray especially because i live in a very humid place so i've got to put hairspray on my curls and i just spray all over baby hairs too that I gotta kind of contain and there we have ow that is how I get my curls there you have it I hope that was helpful I will name all the products I use in the comments below. I know everyone is still sheltering in place, so what better time is it to try out a new hairstyle? I use my hot rollers all the time. When I'm trying to look nice and I don't have a lot of time to curl my hair, I just throw my hot rollers in 15 minutes and I'm set. 
It makes my life just so much easier. I have tons of hair. Curling my hair with a curling iron every day would just take way too long, so hot rollers really do save my life, and I love them. They're super easy. Once you start using them on the regular, like you're just gonna love them, so highly recommend. And that's the end of our video. Thanks so much for watching. If you liked it, go ahead and give it a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell if you wanna get notified every time I upload a video. If you have any questions about how to do this look, don't hesitate to ask me in the comments below. I hope everyone is staying home and staying healthy and positive. Hopefully this will be over soon. I'm still hoping and I'm still praying. I will see you all next week. Bye.